A tough assignment for Bohemians as they headed to Oriel Park, bidding to take out Stephen Kenny's title-chasing side. And they almost gave away an early goal. Shane Supple struggled to clear Dan Byrne's back pass. Pat Hooban unable to capitalise. The doorkeeper Gary Rogers went off after nine minutes with a calf injury, a premature end to his evening as he sought to equal Alan O'Neill's club record of eight clean sheets in a row. Gabriel Sava took over between the posts. The home side, though, not affected by the early alteration. They took the lead after 24 minutes. Hungarian midfielder Christian Adarian on his first league start taken down by Dan Casey. And Patrick Huben confidently converted, sending Shane Supple the wrong way. Ruben's fifth league goal of the season. And the home fans only had to wait seven more minutes for the second goal to arrive. Again, a lovely build-up. Jimmy McGrath's sublime through ball put Sean Gannon in the clear. And the right-back finished calmly from a tight angle to make it 2-0. Bohemians left facing a mammoth task. Michael Duffy again impressed for Dundalk and he almost produced a sensational breakaway goal. Picking up possession just outside his own area, he burst forward, leaving Keith Buckley in his wake. He then cut inside Dara Leahy. Sadly, the finish lacked the required quality and supple gathered. It's not all about attacking flair from the dog. They work hard to win the ball back too. Robbie Benson doing the needful. A Dorian with a drive. Supple taking no chances as he tipped the ball behind. In fairness to Bowes, they plugged away and they had a couple of penalty claims dismissed by the match officials. The first when the ball bounced awkwardly inside the area. Robbie Benson, close at hand. Loud shouts from Bowes players and supporters for a spot kick. It would have been harsh though, but some referees might well have been swayed by the Bowes appeals. And they had another shout when Oscar Brennan won his duel with Duffy. The ball was sent on to Danny Grant. He broke forward, took on Dane Massey. Massey with a risky challenge. No penalty. Graham Kelly, the referee in a good position and confident he had made the right call. In fairness to Grant, he tried to stay on his feet. In the way of modern football, though, Grant's honesty probably didn't do him any favours. Keith Long and Bohemians left to ponder the referee's call. Dundalk's defensive line has yet to be breached, but they had to survive a real goal mouth scramble. Dylan Watts with the pullback for Owen Stokes. Bodies on the line for Dundalk to ensure another shutout. And the home side went close to adding a third goal when McGrath played in Duffy. Shane Supple, though, had his angles right and pushed the ball over the bar. But Duffy got the goal he merited in stoppage time. Sub Stephen O'Donnell and John Mountney combining before Gannon took over and swept the ball into the area. A super turn from Duffy before cracking the ball to the net. And so a fourth win in five matches for Dundalk. Still unbeaten, eight games in, yet to concede.